here um, we have to um, have two possibilities using direct current stimulation or using electrical um, alternating current stimulation. Direct current stimulation is more frequently used. Here we need at least two electrodes on the surface of the head. And indeed, um, we can treat um, um, neurological disorders with, um, for example, abnormal cortical excitability, something like migraine, chronic pain, stroke, with these methods. Um, we are stimulating each day, about for 20 minutes, a very low intensity current, and um, because we have to repeat the stimulation, um, the stimulation uh, frequency, um, I mean, the whole session uh, takes about two weeks. We started to use alternating current stimulation about 2008, because the brain is working with oscillations. So what we are doing, we try to modify abnormal oscillations, restore um, the cortical functions, and um, for example, in cognitive decline, we are using theta or gamma uh, TACS. Um, again, about 20, 25 minutes per day. We had just a longer study. In this study, we stimulated uh, 16 times, three times per week, or four, four, six weeks. We were able to improve, for example, working memory function in elderly after stimulation and even show already during stimulation.